It's movie time. It's gonna review a movie. Yeah. Gonna review a movie trailer now with Joe. Okay, movie review. Just got out of the movie Tusk. This movie is... Um, I guess the best thing about the movie is that it makes you think. Like, what the... F what did I just watch? Um, it's... It's a Kevin Smith movie. It's got all the classic Kevin Smith uh, scenes, a lot of monologues and a lot of uh, great dialogue. Um, you got your really dickish characters and you got your sympathetic characters. Um, yeah, the story, you know what the story is. Um, do you see it unfold? Do you see everything that happens? Yeah, you see it all and it's, it's graphic. And... Um, um, it, is the ending good? The, the good guy and the bad guy, I'm not, I'm not going to spoil anything. The good guy and the bad guy, they fight it out. And, um, there's a winner. That's all I'm going to say. And, um, it's a horror film, so it's disturbing. Okay? Let's get that out of the way. It's a disturbing film. Um, there will be a winner at the end of the fight between the good and the bad guy. It's a horror film, so horror films can go either way. Those sirens in the background, those are for everybody that just watched that movie because not everybody's leaving that movie theater alive. Um, would I watch it again? <sighs> yeah, I'd watch it again. Um, I'd definitely watch it with, with friends. I, I would definitely... So the question isn't, would you watch the movie again? The question is, how many drinks would you have while you're watching the movie? And how inebriated would you be going in to see the movie? Um... Let's see here. The villain's pretty cool. I gotta give it to the villain. The villain's, the villain's pretty awesome. Um, he, he's a total psychopath. Uh, movies are only as good as their villains, and I guess that really holds true for, for horror films. So, yeah, this is... Yeah, it's pretty damn good. Um, there's some cameos in there, some cool little scenes. Um... The last act, pretty cool, and um, so, yeah, the, vi the villain might be the best part in the whole movie. It's really well acted, too. I don't, I don't know if I can say that enough, that, um, you know, they're, they're dealing with crazy, crazy storyline, um, but everybody plays it straight, and um, Justin Long did, did an awesome job. Um, at the end of the day, um, it was pretty, gar pretty darn good. The music was awesome. The music in this film is, uh, right when you get up to the, the bad guy's house and towards the end, some scenes, you got some really, uh, weird music that doesn't normally go along with the scenes that you, you're accustomed to seeing in, in horror films. So that was cool. Um, there's a lot of comedy in the movie and a lot of, um, yeah, a lot of crude, rude humor. Um, that's not a turnoff. It's just, you know, it is what it is. And, um, what else can I say about the film? The last, the last 25 minutes are insanely, are just insane. You never seen anything like it before. It's out there, um, and then the very end, um, it's just like, what? Not in a bad way, just, they went as, they pushed the envelope as far as they could go, and then they pushed it 30 feet more. Yeah.